Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel and to the Decades Challenge. Now, I was just playing through the night here to get us ready for the next day for recording and Mary has aged up into 18 during the night. So I've hopped on to start the recording early so that you guys can see this. Excuse me, yawning already. Now, her traits were serial romantic and she wanted to be a goofball that's what the random generator had for her so that is what we are going to do and we are going to have to take her into command center right now and fix her up because she doesn't look right so as soon as that loads up we can do that um i'm a bit distracted at the minute because i do have a lot going on in real life and i am just about managing to keep up with the recording for you guys um but i am managing it so you know i'm not gonna worry and it's nothing to worry about everything is absolutely fine i'm just busy with charity work and stuff at the moment so right let's have a look with you darling full body now every day for a start what do we have for you every day well we're gonna have to give you pretty similar to what everybody else is wearing because you wouldn't be able to afford more than they can um so we'll give you that one and you can have the same colour as your mum, that is fine. Your formal wear, we can probably give you a little bit of a fancier dress for that. No, we want the long dresses, thank you. Um, so we will go with that one for your formal. These kids are all very, very blessed in the boob department, all of them. Um, sports wear, you're going to have to just wear your usual um, long dress because you just wouldn't have actually done that much sport to be honest. And I'm on short dresses again. What a noob. Um, sleepwear. Where's that dress that we had for the sleepwear? That's the one. We will give it you in that colour. There you go. That's your nighty sorted. Party wear. Um, I'll probably just go similar to your formal wear to be fair. Similar to your formal wear. Some of these seem to be showing up twice. Oh, no, they're not. That looks rather Elizabethan. Very Elizabethan. Quite like that. But I don't think yeah. it's going to work for your formal wear, my darling. We're going to have to go with... But not in green. No, not in green. We're going to go with a nice purple colour. There we go. And your swimwear, this is where it gets difficult. Because we'll have to put you in a short dress for swimwear and pretend it's like... um. A one-piece bathing suit or something like they used to wear. So that is you sorted, my darling. You are sorted. We can get through the night now. Jabez has gone back to war, which is very, very sad. Um, I know I got a little bit emotional when he turned up the other day. But that's just because I get so attached to my sims. And just ignore my phone bleeping. I have people sending me messages on Skype and Facebook and all sorts of stuff today. Um... I'll just leave it bleep into itself and answer if it's needed. Come along, guys. Come along. Get this loaded for me. There we go, guys. And I am back now. Everybody, I know everybody's hungry. I know they all are. Um, but they need a good night's sleep as well. Like, your energy's not horrendous. So go and have yourself a quick meal of cereal and then you can go back to bed because... There you go, cereal. And then go back to bed, darling, because you are absolutely... Why do you need to spray the monster under the... No, you don't. You just need to sleep. Okay. So you go and do that for me, darling, because you are absolutely starving. Tomorrow we're going to have to clean this place up and we're going to try and get the... F oh, excuse me. Excuse me, the farm under control and everything else. She's sad because it was a forgotten birthday. We know it was a forgotten birthday, darling. We know, but with the war going on and the house being bombed and everything else... We just forgot. I'm so sorry. Which one are you? Dorcas. Let's have a look at you, darling. You're hungry. And your hygiene's low, right? Go on. Go and have a bath. Wake up at 2 o'clock in the morning, 3 o'clock in the morning. Go and have a bath. Why not? Why not? All these kids are stinking. One of the kids is missing. Who's missing? You're sleeping. Oh, no. They're not missing. It's because she aged up into a team it's okay so this family is having a really really rough time right now and they're all going to have to pull together and get this farm sorted um, and clean up good girl and then go back to sleep that's fine I'll allow you to do that let's have a look what's going on with the farm 
here at the minute. Right, yeah, we've got quite a lot planted, but we are going to have to plant some more, and we're not going to have the time to worry about, like, evolving and stuff like that. What does everybody have in their inventory? Can I set some extra stuff out for planting? Because, no, the flowers we can't do. The reason I'm saying that is because um, at this time we would have had directives from um, the government to tell us that we needed to increase our planting. And if we're going to be realistic, we need to make sure that's done. And it's going to be a lot of hard work, like a lot of hard work. But it's something that we need to do, you know. It, it is something that's going to have to be done. Right, Basil. So while they're all sleeping the night away, because I had to jump on early. Why can't we plant Basil? Okay. Because we had to jump on early, I was figuring we might as well um, take care of the farm and stuff while we're here. I want you to... Why won't you let me? Come on. Place in world. Let's do it that way. Nope, don't do that. Stop. My goodness. There we go. Now we're cooking with gas. Um, it is going to be very tough going. It is going to be very tough going. And some of these kids are going to have days where they don't even go to school because they're too busy helping mum and stuff around the farm. And that's fine. That that's Did I just plant it in the wrong place? I did. What a nub. Um, they're going to be too busy helping out around the farm and everything else that's going on. It's... It's a tough time for everybody. It's a tough time for everybody. But to make it realistic, this is what we need to do. You know, we're going to have to increase the amount that we produce. Not as much as we would have to increase it for World War II. World War II was a lot worse rations-wise. Um, but we would still have to increase. And, of course, when you're selling to the government, you're basically only getting your money back on what you produce. So, um... Oh, my God! I am so bad at this today. So bad at this today. Um, yeah, you would just be getting your money back a lot of the time on what the government produced. Um, sorry, what the government paid would be basically what, what it was worth. Like, you wouldn't get much of a profit from it. Um, they will get some profit because they need to encourage them to keep going. And also, you're going to have locals who are coming to them and buying stuff off them because they've run out of rations and stuff like that, you know. Um, they can buy directly from the farmers, but it was a tough time for everybody, it was. Right, stop. Thank you, what's this one? I've just planted the basil, right? Did I not just put basil down? I swear, yeah, I did. Yes, I did. Okay, so there's mushrooms. We'll plant a few more with those while we're waiting for everybody to wake up. Okay. Let's see what else. Do we need anything else? At the moment, I think that's going to give us, other than this one, this one needs a bit more. That's parsley. I've already got parsley over there, so I don't know why I've got parsley there as well. So we'll ignore that. Um, onions, I've got two lots of them as well for some strange reason. This dragon fruit we're definitely going to need to plant more of because that's going to be our money maker um, and grow fruit as well. Stop. That is not what I wanted you to do. Um, and, sorry, the grow fruit as well. That's that's going to be a big money maker for us. Um, I'm clicking everywhere. Guys, I've got no idea what I'm even doing today. It's because I should have done this off camera, but because of their um, birthday and stuff, I jumped back on to get it done quick. So, right, darling, let's have a look at you. You're awake, okay? It's still early. Why don't you go back to bed? Are you fully rested? You need to eat. Okay, look. Everybody stinks. Everybody needs to eat. It's ridiculous. Is this spoiled? No, right. Go and eat eggs and toast. Go and eat eggs and toast while I take care of this, please. Um, I'm not sure that we actually get... A farmer come in today I'm not sure whether we do um, we'll have to wait and see but for the time being these kiddiewinks can kind of step up a little bit and help out you know let's move you over there and you over there right that should be enough for the extras for today right what I'm actually gonna do now guys is I'm just gonna quickly cut out and then go back come back in when they are actually 
up and doing stuff. And good morning guys. Everybody is starting to wake up now. Um, there's a lot going on. She needs something to eat. Right, let's start taking care of their needs. Getting them all squared away. Right, darling, go and get yourself. Um, you can't really cook. So, well, you could. Um, just serve some breakfast for everybody of pancakes. Go and do that. And then you can get something to eat now. What's up with you, darling? Your hygiene's low, your bladder's low, your social and your fun are low. Okay, let's take care of those one at a time. We're not going to take care of your hygiene right now because you're going to do some gardening. So you can do that and then maybe you can vent to your sister. You can um, have a deep conversation with her. You can come compliment yes compliment her outfit because it's a new one and you can ask about day because that'll help get both your socials up and then we can worry about the gardening you my darling are hungry and you're getting something to eat that's fine your fun and your hygiene are low we'll take care of your hygiene later um but can you come and for me fix this no that's not broken that's why clean that and repair that for me please um right you sweetheart your hunger's low but you're still sleeping when you wake up you can have something to eat that's not a problem you darling are going to talk to him can you not eat that look just eat the scrambled eggs eat the scrambled eggs and you need to sleep just go and sleep in your sister's bed cry it out and sleep for a little while you, my darling, are pretty okay other than needing to pee, so you can go and pee. And you, darling, are... Your social's not bad. Your fun's really low. Um, hug. Talk. Play. Um, play again. That should get your fun up. Right, you, darling, are cooking for everybody. Your hunger's low. Other than that, you are fine. So... Don't even. Your social's still low. Your hygiene is very low. That's fine. But can we go and talk to somebody and get your hygiene up? And not your hygiene, sorry, your social up. Come and talk to your sister. Come on. Vent. Tell dramatic story. Okay. And share ideas. I know you stink, but whatever. Just get your social up a little bit. There we go. Your social's going up. Your hygiene's low, but your social's going up. Good girl, Sarah, reached cooking level 9. So when you've done all that, darling, this is important. Now I need you to go and start planting. So plant, and then we'll see if you carry on planting all of them. Hopefully you will, hopefully you will. And we should be getting you a boyfriend fairly soon. Why are you sat on your daughter? That's a glitch and a half, isn't it? Um, right. You're having a shower, that's fine. You are going to sleep. That's fine. Then I want you to... Where's, where's the food that your mum cooked? Where is it? I don't even know. Come and repair this before everything gets damaged and I want you to clean up, okay? It's important that you do. And then once you've done that, you can get upstairs and you can help um, watering everything. You, darling, get a little bit of sleep and then you can come and help and water everything. Okay, and there's not a lot you can do, so... Good girl. I hope these all line up nicely where they're supposed to and I don't have to fix them later, but anyway. You get on with that. Sarah, darling, you're going to have to come up and um, start watering as well. This farm is getting ridiculously big, guys. Ridiculously big and it's going to be a handful. These kids are all going to have to pitch in. You... Come and 
Can you spray for bugs? I don't know whether you can or not. Don't know whether the level is high enough even. Oh yeah, it is. There you go. Excuse me, guys. <coughs> oh, sorry about that. I've got a new um wax melt for my candle burner and it seems to be triggering my allergies off. I get really snuffly every time it's been burning for more than a little while, so... I am going to have to um, probably replace that one fairly soon because it's starting to get on my nerves. Right, wake up you. And wake up you because you can have another nap this afternoon if you need to. But right now we need to get this farm taken care of. Right, Kitty Winks. You're fine. So why... Oh, there you go. His mood's changed. You are uncomfortable. That's fine. You play with him and then come and get a quick meal of cereal and you will be fine. At least they're all talking to each other while they're working, which is kind of important. Right, sweetheart, what are you doing? Come over here and water. Come on, the more of you water in, the faster this is going to go. Zephora's planting everything. I'm going to have to move some of them, but anyway, that is fine. Let's whiz through this a little bit. Everybody's mood seems really bad. I mean, I know it's probably natural. They're in the middle of this depression thing and stuff that's going on um they've lost the house their dad's away at war they are all going to be miserable so i suppose it's natural but it's just it's horrible for me to see so many orange sims it's it's not nice right sweetheart have you finished upgrading yes and you're going to come and help so that's fine everybody gets on with it um are you still spraying for bugs no right come and spray for more bugs come on you do the spraying. Your mum's doing some watering. Your sister's doing some planting. <clears throat> if you can hear that screaming from the other room, I do apologise. We have um, a teenager and a toddler kind of screaming at each other right now. But I am sure it will settle down in a few moments. It usually does. Strappy, strappy kids, you know? It's what happens. It's what happens. Right. <clears throat> some of these are not lined up to my taste but we will fix that off camera that's not a problem you keep doing that you keep doing that who's missing where are you you're doing that one what are you doing you're having something to eat well i will let you do that that is fine that's fine what are you doing you're having something to eat as well grand as soon as you finish having something to eat you can get your butt back out here though get your butt back out here That's it, you water it just as she plants it. No problem, Mama. No problem at all. Some of them might get missed or whatever, but anyway. Come on, Ziffy, you're doing a great job. What's the matter, Sarah? You need to pee, then go and pee. Oh, did you just pee yourself? No? Right. Go and use that. And go and repair that. Somebody else was meant to do it, but whatever. Go and do it. Okay, how are you doing, Ziffy? Where are you going? I haven't said you can go for a bath yet. You're not done. You're not done. You can have a bath when you're done. Come here and plant. Thank you. Now, who are we missing? You're coming back to plant good, uh, water, good girl. You can get your butt up here and water as well. Come on. Get everything watered. Get on top of it for when the gardener comes again. And you, darling, why are you sleeping again? I haven't said, oh, but you sent the telegram for a birthday. Awesome. Um, Get out of here and spray for bugs. No, no bugs there. No bugs that need spraying for? I don't see any, which is good. Right, okay, that's fine. Do we need to weed anything? Doesn't look like it. Yep, let's go weeding. There we go. Come on, Ziffy. You're doing a great job, my darling. You're doing a fantastic job and you can now go for a bath. Okay, that has got to be fixed. I'm sorry. I can't. I can't do it. I can't do it. My OCD is kicking in. It's not even funny. Right, there we go. There we go. Done. 
Now, while I'm in here, I might as well fix these ones. Because that one's too far over and it can't even go there now, which is ridiculous. Come on. What is going on? Okay, it's not letting me put it there. If it wants a gap there, we'll give it a gap there. Whatever, I'm not bothered. Okay, and you don't want to go there and you can't go there because of the water, which is a pain in the butt. But okay. We will pop you there and then you're still in line and I don't have to stress about it. There we go. Done. Done, done, done. Right, so the farm is looking absolutely fantastic at the minute. It's not looking bad at all. Everybody's kind of miserable, but the farm is taken care of. Um, we'll let them finish watering. Tomorrow's going to be a harvest day by the look of it. And I'm going to try and get Ziffy to do all the harvesting because that way it's just easier to sell stuff. So the other kids can do the weeding and whatever else. Sarah can help out where she needs to help out. That's it, sweetheart. Come back and do some watering for me. You all need some serious, serious fun. So I think we're going to have to have another dance party so, fairly soon. Fairly soon. These kids are all working together and it's awesome to see. It really is. Right, who are you? You're there. See if he's having a bath. Mary. Water. Please, there you go. Not you. I didn't want Ziffy to water. Mary. Water. Okay. There we go. We're watering. We're watering. And I think that's all the watering and all the gardening done, which is awesome. Now, you need some fun and your energy is a little bit low, but that's fine. Come down here and dance a while. Well, actually, don't dance a while. Mop that up. Scavenge for parts. And then come and dance. Okay. What are you doing, sweetheart? You're reading a book for some fun. That is absolutely fine. You are taking a bath, I assume. No, you're coming to dance. Don't dance. Go upstairs. Take a bath. And then you can come and dance, okay? Um, you're reading a book for some fun. Your hunger's down a bit as well as your social. So, okay, you do that and you probably chat to your mum while you're doing it. You are chatting with her and your social's down, so that's fine. Come on over here and dance, and you can probably chat to people at the same time as doing that. You're cleaning up, and then you're going to have a dance, so that's fine. You're taking a bath, good lad, and you are asleep, my darling. Wake yourself up, and come and sit and have a chat with your mother. Share brilliant ideas, reveal a deep secret. Um, do an impression. Why are you asleep, Annie Mariah? That'd be you then. Wake up. I know your energy's low, but you won't sleep if you... Come and dance. That'll get you. And you should be able to chat at the same time then. And you should, yeah. Definitely. Um... I feel a bit confused as to what's going on today, guys. Like, totally in my head, nothing's making any sense. So, <clears throat> just one of those days, and I am fine, but just distracted as usual. I've got literally about 40 seconds left on this Let's Play. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave these guys having some fun, because they all deserve it. They all deserve a good day dance and a good chat and everything else so we're going to leave them having some fun cheering themselves up and if you've enjoyed the episode and you're enjoying the series don't forget to leave a big thumbs up on the video comments and suggestions sorry guys excuse me <coughs> i think i'm coming down with the cold comments and suggestions as always in the comments box down below and if you haven't hit subscribe please hit subscribe now and join the family and i am going to see you guys in the next episode ciao for now guys